Hello mate, what can I get for you? Oh, I've already got one, thanks mate. Have you seen my missus? <laughs> <laughs> what can I get for you in that pigeon thing? Pigeon thing? Stabiliser thing. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Hello there everyone, how are we doing? Monday fun day, back to it, back to the grind, back to the workplace, which is good. It's not Monday, it's Tuesday. Yesterday was bank holiday Monday. <laughs> Idiot, forgot that. God, it's not long till the pubs and the gyms reopen, that's good news, looking forward to that. As well as, it's not long until we move office. That is now common knowledge, we'll put a snippet about that in this vlog. And now this is a new office that would potentially, well, not potentially, we've signed it, it's happening. Oh yeah, and you're probably wondering, damn, what's your outfit of choice today, aren't you? Hmm, probably. This hat, North Face, from the outlet. There's an outlet North Face store in London that I went to. This shirt, charity shop, is one of those Ico Pucho. Aya Cucho. This t-shirt, Otter, four year anniversary t-shirt. Trousers, H&M, socks, next, shoes, Converse. Good stuff, thanks for coming. Happy Christmas vlog. Can't believe it's Christmas again already. What a wonderful year it's been. Look at the absolute state of this. It's beginning to look like, like Christmas. It never looks as bad on camera, does it? It's coming down. Bloody coming down. I don't know if I'm gonna make it home. I, I think we're gonna be snowed in, mate. We might have to leave early. We might have to huddle like penguins. Tuesday evening, just coming up to six o'clock, heading down to the new space, meeting Matt Cole and Ben there to discuss building plans. What's the next step? What's it gonna look like? Etc. Etc. Getting in my car now. See ya. I like your uh okay. that is uh Hi everyone, it's Wednesday already. That's because we lost Monday because of the bank holiday. This is a bit of a first for a little while. I've been first in. Joss is usually the first in. Ben and I slowly follow. Oh. So how are you doing? How's your week? Yeah? Well, that's not too bad, thanks. Yeah, yeah, me too. Mm. Yes. This, ladies and gentlemen, is a is a utility vest. And it's got so many pockets. I think I've outdone you for once on pockets. Yeah, mate. Sorry about that. Don't worry about that. Hey, Joss, what are you doing, mate? Uh... Cutting out some nooch. Uh, I'm currently in Photoshop. I'm just taking. Oh, I didn't vlog it. I know you didn't. Oh, why don't you, you shame me? Stupid boy! It's Friday, Friday. It's gotta get down on Friday. Oh, 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 oh. Don't put that in. Uh, yes, everyone. How are we doing? Happy Easter, Shaggers. That's what Josh wrote on the whiteboard. Someone wrote this, though. We don't know who did it. It definitely wasn't me because my D's are not like that. My D is very different to that. Although Joss, someone put this drawing here. Also this here. You probably are wondering, what's this little thing here? Well, this is a story time. That is a Wiltshire police notice that I got handed once. It was the first time I'd ever been pull pulled over by the police officers, the lovely police officers of Swindon Wiltshire. We got pulled over because she had an illegal license plate. Um, wasn't our fault because it wasn't our license plate. It was on the car when we bought it. Wonderful, got fined. Absolutely shat myself in the back of that police car. Never again. Also, AirPods. Not my ones, because I can't find them. Good times, good times. Confetti, confetti. Boys, Stop. we've made it. When's the plaque coming? You don't get one. Retiring. Or more confetti? Yeah. Yeah. You know what this was? You know what this means? We're getting consistent views on the vlogs. Yeah, we've been up, we've been up in the game on YouTube, and you know, it's, it's, it's been paying off. Amen, amen, amen. Respect. Gang spot. Gang spot. There you have it folks. Something that's very, very small in the grand scheme of things. It means quite a lot to us, so thanks everyone for subscribing. We've made it. We can now happily all retire from YouTube. Thanks, Dean. Big up Daniel Din <laughs> Dinsey for being our hundredth subscriber. Dan, let us know your uh, your size, we'll send you a t-shirt. Oh uh, yeah, nice one, thanks everyone. Sorry that I've taken over you on the pocket front. That's fine. Kind of saw it and I thought, you know what, I want a bit of that, so that's why I got it. Guess where I got it from, Joss? Pretend that you don't know. Oh, I don't know. Is it? Uh, no, it's not Boohoo. I don't shop for Is it a, a little Carhartt number? It's not Carhartt, no. It was a high street retailer. High street retailer? You're telling me that also, that. Also, stocks, food, and household goods. You're telling me that that is from a supermarché? Straight from a supermarché. Straight from the middle aisle of the infamous Audi supermarché. A L D I. Aldi. Aldi. It's got 
so many pockets. It's got this pocket, look. That's a pocket there. There's a pocket behind that pocket. And then there's a pocket on the front of that pocket. Three pockets in one space. Oh, have I suddenly become the nooch man? Yes, I have. Two nooches in two pockets. I've got another one in here. This pocket here. Very good. Oh yeah, I'll put this one in this pocket. This pocket is also known as my waterproof phone pocket. Waterproof phone? You never know where you're gonna get caught out. Put the phone in there, waterproof. Put that in there. Oh, what about another barista milk? What about another milk? Should we put that in there? Yeah, go on then. Oh, what about another nooch? Loaded, mate, absolutely loaded. This utility vest can fit two milk cartons and four packets of nooch. So we're down at the Tap and Brew, about to film their new van. I've got the farmer haircut on the go. Josh is on the gimbal. Gimbal. How is it, J-Dog? Yeah, it's good, mate. It's been uh, probably like October, November since we've used it, to be fair. So obviously one of the issues shooting with the R5 over the C200 is that it's not got any ND filters built in. So we always have to kind of play with the aperture for the sunlight. My F8, I've just dropped my ISO down to 250. We're at 1 100th of a second as well, because we're at 50 frames, so. Yeah. And it's going to be super bright. I reckon it's going to keep bouncing in and out of the clouds. It is a bit of a pain, to be fair. What's the plan with the shots? Uh, get like a nice wide, big walk around of the van. As you can see, it's got a really cool design, so we want to make the most of that. And then walk up inside and hopefully get someone pouring beer. Hello mate, what can I get for you? Oh, I've already got one, thanks mate. Have you seen my missus? <laughs> <laughs> what can I get for you in that pigeon thing? Pigeon thing? Stabiliser thing. Thanks to Daryl at the Central Library in Swindon. What Thank you, Daryl! What a legend. Uh, he has been working with me on the Brunel project and the photos that he has found in his collection are crispy and lovely. We're looking for, forward to getting down into the Central Library there and uh, have a look at the collection ourselves, aren't we? Yeah, this is as you asked for. Thank you, John. No worries. Uh, yes, so you'll catch me Central Library, 9am tomorrow morning. Also, on a, on a separate note, pubs and stuff reopen on uh, Monday. Don't forget to go down and support your local pub who've been suffering throughout this whole crisis that we've been living. Um, anyways, uh, downstairs they've got new tables outside. Do you want to have a look at them? Yeah, sure, okay. So high up up here, Dan. Yeah. You know, as, 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 as great as it is to be seven foot on Tinder, when you go into normal sized houses, it's just like this happens all the time. Like, yeah. this is what it's like in my bedroom. And, you know, I have to really struggle to move about. So, you know, I just wish, wish you were smaller sometimes because being seven foot, it's not easy. Oh. And this is another struggle of being a business owner is how tall you become. This is about to go in the bin. <laughs> Look home. Oh. Uh, Dan, here's the scissors you asked for. Will you been in the other one as well? That's the funeral song, isn't it, for plants? No, it's... Da, da, di, da, 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 da. And when we move into the office, we're going to get new plants. And when we move into the office, we're going to look after those plants. We're not going to butcher them. I'm going to be... Hello Ben speaking. So we are, as you may uh, already know, we are moving out of this office. Yeah. Then means we're gonna to have to move all of this stuff to the new venue, which should take roughly 20 hours to do. Is that my wallet? My wallet. Oh Ben, hang on. Here's the scissors you are. <laughs> Thanks mate, look at these. Hello Ben speaking. 